It's time. Welcome back to Antichamber. I deserve a red gun. Let's go get a red gun. I only need... Oh, right. You just walk through. I was confused for a second. And I do remember that that's a trap door. Don't need to go there now, though. Oh! Up! Yellow! Just use yellow to go up. You're not even really meant to just get tons of blocks and just pillar up, I guess. If that's how that means, that actually makes sense, because this is a whole lot easier than doing it that way, but it's not like you have to use this way. You can definitely do just the normal blue block pillar up, but fair enough. That's fine. That's a neat little touch. And now we solve this again, and... Yeah, once again, I can't, like, paint in... Oh, into this thing. So I just have to do it the way I did it before. So I move it over here. Oh, over there. Oh, over there, and then there. And then we remove one block and move it down. Oh. There. And then we do the same. And now I just move it in. Like so. Easy enough. Red gun! Get! Powered up and all of the cubes I had just transform into red. There comes a time when you can work your way through anything. Basically saying, you're done. This is your final form. Enjoy. Alright. Cool. Hold, hold. Okay, so I can do this to tell it to go someplace, and then I also hold right click at the same time. Aha! And it just absorbs all connected cubes from the point of the cube that you're pointing at. So if I just paint a line here, however I want, then if I hold here and then hold right click, it'll drain from both ends. Or I guess the, the furthest one maybe? Yeah, the furthest one. And just pull the cubes into your, your grasp. Alright. So that's how red works. But red also works where... Uh... Oh, how was that again? Like if I touch... Some some other color. I mean, that'll probably be a tutorial later on here, so let's just actually do the tutorial. So yeah, you just, whoops, don't do that. I see, and this is like a reverse door. These have to be uncovered for the door to open. So yeah, hold this and hold right. And then we walk through, and I could, I could have blocked that if I aimed properly. Oh, and you can fill, wow, you can fill in gaps or entire sections as well the further we get the less help we need so hold this and then hold left click wow that's really fucking cool holy crap can i hold left click first and then right click no oh i can do that though so i can place a block oh my god that's awesome Oh, and yeah, I don't need to do this. I, I don't need to do that at all. This whole, like, oh, I need to take every single block. You just hold down one button and then just absorb all of the blocks in. So now we can make, like, platforms and shit. And walls. Wow. That is really fucking cool. Nice. Oh, and that's, of course, how you're meant to get through that red giant block that I did, I just like spam right click through it to get through the, the corridor like two episodes ago or no, that was more than that. I don't even know. But yeah, you're just meant to drain it all. So that makes sense. That's really cool. And yeah, we fill in this door opens and we get one more exit room. Getting to the end requires tying off loose ends. Oh, that's something I forgot to do. I forgot to check where I actually, when I got to the exit the first time, and then the second time. 
because I can't remember getting to the exit when I had the blue gun. I don't know. Oh, hey! Wait, so... Aha! Wait, I think I understand. So I need to just get a hole in here, and then I can just... Oh! No, I can't. Ah, no. I thought, like, fill it in with red blocks and then the birds can't remove those blocks, the red blocks, but no, they can. Surely there must be a way to get in here. Wait, I can't drain this, right? No, I can't drain it. I mean, I got one block in there, but... Not more than that. Eh. There's probably something I'm missing. There's probably a way to get in here, but for now, let's ignore that. What's this again? Yeah, that's where I came from. Okay. And I went here last time, so now... We can go this way, and, of course, I can just place all my cubes and just cover the entire fucking world in red cubes. Oh my god. This is insane. That sound is, like, in my brain. Sure, let's fucking completely wall us in. Oh my god, it's kind of glitching out as well. But that's fine, now we have a lot of... What? Oh, the birds eat up these as well. Huh. All right, well, I should have enough anyway. And same deal here. Oh. But this is a problem. I get four cubes, but... Maybe that's something... Oh, whoa, whoa! Oh, I see! You just get more cubes because every time... It only takes one cube to expand it by one. Hold on, so if I expand this the entire way and then... Uh, let's just do, like, another one. Oh, no. Well, didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. Now, if I take one cube, two cubes, I need two cubes to start. So one I place... And then I hold down left click. Wait, what just happened? Okay, no. So hold down left click and then hold down or press middle mouse. Yeah, it takes one cube and makes it into five. So now the game is teaching us that as long as you have two or more cubes, you have infinite cubes. Holy crap. That is insane. This power is insane. That is so cool. And I suck them all out, and there we go. The best solutions may still be the most primitive ones, just duplicating cubes, but in a different way? I don't know. And of course, we still can't get these, like, through... those walls, no. Nope, it just destroys them. Alright, that's fine. Huh. Guess I have to drop? Yeah? For now? Falling down teaches us how to get up and try again. So I need to go... Oh yeah, I can just get some blocks here. Whoops! Oh, didn't mean to... Okay, they come back. Yeah? So you can basically... Wait, so you can just duplicate cubes by doing this? And I just get more and more cubes, just infinitely. Look at that fucking giant pile I have now. Holy crap. By doing this, every time I'm getting exponentially more cubes per growth cycle, and I spend less cubes because there's only one for each individual growth thing. That is insane. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Man, what a fucking crazy game. Alright, can I please... No, wrong way, god damn it. 
What? Wait, what is happening? Why can I not grow this one? That's not it. I think I hold left click first. Yeah, I can't do that. I, I guess I actually just move it then. Whoops. Huh. But yeah, that's a problem. How the fuck do you... Do you do that? I thought I understood this, but clearly I do not. There's something I'm missing. And if I tell it to move in here, and then click left click, then no. Nope. Hmm. Maybe I start by doing this and then left click? No? No, that's not it either. Yeah, I, I actually don't know. Can I do... If I do this... And then tell it to... Hmm. No. If I tell it to move up here and then... Cancel that, no. Alright, I'm actually out of ideas here for right now, but I guess we can just go up here. That's easy enough. Oh, can I, like, place one up here? And then do that? Oh, well, I mean, I guess I can. It doesn't really do what I wanted it to, but that's fine. Oh, still not enough. And of course, I can still fly up if I want to. Oh, whoops. Make a little bit of a bigger hole. Yeah, I can get there easily enough. You can't do everything yourself. Oh. Oh. Of course. Yeah, that's, that's the classic thing. Turn and then turn again. Oh, right, the thing in the top of the breaking the arc looked like this. So it might be like you have to get up to the top and then look straight up and then you teleport somewhere. I don't know, but yeah, we can do that. Oh, different room. Oh, I see. Oh, shit, it's like, oh, God. Frame rate kind of tanked for it. Yeah, for a second, it's tanking again. Oh no, it's been so good for all of these episodes, but maybe not anymore. Yeah, now I'm here again. And that's it, just two different ones. Nowhere else. Alright, fair enough. This might hurt the performance, but... Let's just try it. Oh, I can go left here as well. Okay. Oh. Oh. I see. Ah. Oh, man. I feel like I'm in that part I saw up by the red gun. I looked through a window and saw, like, some weird ominous shadow-looking room. And we still have these circles. And I still don't know if they do anything. There's one there. Oh my god. What have I gotten myself into? Is that where I came from? Did I just teleport? I feel like I just teleported. Now I'm in blue. 
And now that's red. Yep, definitely teleporting quite a bit. Oh, I see. I just solved it accidentally. You're just supposed to back into the room. Or just enter it without looking. No? Maybe look at this thing? Ah, that's probably it. So is that something where, like, looking at them changes something? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. What is fucking happening in this game? Uh, what's down here? Nothing? What's all the sound that's going on? Oh, and I can't get these. I thought these were green locks. There's two different corridors here. Maybe. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna go down one of these first, because the other one looks more real and significant and important. Oh, I just end up on the same place? Yeah, I do. What is that? Look at that. I don't know if that's intended or just a weird rendering issue. Okay, let's walk through it backwards the entire way and see if it changes anything. Nope. Not that I can tell. So I'm not sure if this is anything at all. Probably. I'm sure I just don't understand. Oh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Invisible path. Whoop. Oh, is it another one of these? Yeah, if you jump, you fall down. Alright. Oh, crap. So, wait. I can't get up this, though. Unless I can, like, jump really early. No? Huh. How the hell do you do that, then? Maybe if I walk? If only I could stop it from appearing. Then I could stop it when it's, like that or something so I have one block to step onto and it's not based on where I look and we're getting some weird eerie violin or something going on in the background yeah I I don't know what to do here And there's no way I could have cubes coming in here, right? I can't really remember. Yeah, this is just an infinite loop. Yeah? I'm very confused by this part. I guess I have to leave this for now and go somewhere else. That's too much for me. Laying the foundation, a loop that won't close. Falling forward. Red cross. Yeah, red cross I cannot solve right now. And then this is another one of those circles, which... I still don't understand. Huh. And this is back to being a spinny cross. Well. Fair enough, I suppose. Maybe we can do this one now? I can just drain all of the cubes in the known universe. Yeah, like that. Oh! Aha! So if I look at this and then back... Aha! Alright, so that's what those are meant to be. Like, look at this and don't look where you're going and something else changes. 
So that's what I need to pay attention to. Oh god. Oh, there we go. I see. Holy crap. Wait. No, that just... took me into the same... Hold on. Go back there again. Because that's different. Yeah, there's a wall here now. Whoa. Okay, I'm just hitting this part. Alright, so we back in, turn around, and turn around like twice more. But now... It's the same one here, but it actually is a different area that I'm in. But if I jump out here... This is the same area, but when I get back in, we're still in this second edition of this. Oh! Isn't that new? Now I kind of want to load a backup and test this out. I might do that in between episodes, but if I had only the yellow gun, I don't think I could place blocks through one of these fields. Sure, I can't place it in the field, but I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure I would have tried that, right? But yeah, like, I can definitely just... Oh yeah, I can just do this as well. And then walk in. And drain all those again. And since we're not actually in one of these fields, I can have them. And you just have to do that all the time. Just move them over here. Drain them again. Whoops. Oh no, because right here, okay, hold on, hold on. Now we need more, more blocks. That's fine, more than enough. Let's just make a, a cube wall here, just in case. That's enough. So I do that, drain it, and then move it over here. But now, I'll save this one, I suppose. Now we have to just pull it there. Yeah. I don't feel like I could do this before, but again, I need to test this out. I need to load a backup and confirm this. Wait, what now? Okay, it's fine. So we can get over there. Oh, no, stop! <laughs> okay, it's like killing itself. You need to be careful of that. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Did we even need anything? Any cubes here? Yeah, we do. I mean, this other one seems simpler. I think I'm just gonna do this one first. Because this seems very straightforward. So there. Just take two cubes. And there we go. I'll take a couple more just so I can duplicate. The more we complete, the harder it gets to find what we missed. Really? Oh, I'm back here. Oh god, and then if I walk back now, obviously this is gone again, and this is breaking the arc. I mean, sure, let's get in here. Oh, need more. Oh yeah, I can just do that. Infinite cubes. Not that that's anything remarkable at this point, when I have infinite cubes wherever I want. But I can open that. And... Can I now... Place this, like, inside there? I can't? Can I make it move inside there? I can't. So this is a different type of field... ...than the other one. Oh, shit! I think maybe I understand. Hold on, let me dump all my cubes here. Repaint the walls. Just 
Just make a different room entirely. Maybe it's just the fact that I'm looking down. I usually look down or like to the side or whatever. Maybe I just need to look straight up. Holy fucking shit, that's awesome! That is so fucking cool, I love this game. This game is so fucking good. Oh my god, attention to detail can lead to very rewarding outcomes. I fucking love this game so much. This is one of the best games I've played in years. Oh. God damn, it's so fucking cool. And that is like the end, this is what I was seeing. Yeah, here's the red... Red gun. I guess I just dropped down. And I'm in this part now. And now we go back up. Aha. Go up. Holy shit. This game just doesn't cease to amaze me. This is like putting a giant fucking shit eating grin on my face. It's so cool. Oh my god. Wait, what? But... This is a... Oh, this is a different area. Life is full of ups and downs. Can I go anywhere? Can I walk out here? No. And I guess I just jump across again? Uh, do I just fall down once more? Yeah, I'm in a different area now, and then I go up again. Oh man, I really should end off the episode, but we gotta see where this goes now. This way. Just the very last thing, let's see what happens here. Oh! And that's just there. Huh. That can't be right. Are you meant to get the red gun? Where are you supposed to do all of what I just did with the yellow gun? Again, okay, I'm gonna end it off here and then I'm gonna test just off camera. I'll just load the backup where I have the yellow gun and I'm just gonna confirm that I can't do what I did before and just bypass that entire giant section of cube eating corridors. Because maybe I can, and I was just placing it on the part that ate the cubes instead of through into the safe zone. I can't remember, so I'll check that out. Because maybe that was just meant to be one way to get to the red gun, but... I mean, just going up from the walk sign seems straightforward to me, and way more simplistic and easy to figure out, and easy to spot. But hey, at least this section was so fucking cool. So it's got that going for it. Hope you enjoyed the episode, thank you for watching, I'll see you next time, bye bye!